what's up everybody it's potato panda tv here today and um this is gonna be uh, another video let's see all right of course it's a funko pop video but um this is kind of a little haul video i've got that uh because i had ordered uh or not only ordered but i was kind of participating in a couple like live auctions on the on a this one app called whatnot and i know i've mentioned I think I mentioned whatnot in my last video so um I actually participated in a couple auctions on whatnot and I think I still have one one more Funko Pop from an auction I participated in that should be coming I hope sometime this week but or I think that I still think I still have one more coming in this week but I'll have to check my whatnot app again but um I think there's one of these ones was one I had gotten just because like I was in a in an auction and they were doing like a giveaway and I just happened to I think enter the giveaway and I just happened to get the or be the one that got it and then uh one of the other or the other ones were ones I had participated in where they were I, think, I believe it was like a viewer or a what are they called viewer's choice where they just have an auction and then I think I, where they have us like a wall or a small wall of her Funko Pops on like on a table or something and like whoever wins the auction gets to pick the whatever Funko with the, off the wall that they want to pick and there's one of them actually I sort of didn't really want to get because I was just kind of I, <laughs> one of those stupid things where I just kind of was bidding on one just to kind of just to kind of see how the auction was going and accidentally or not really accidentally but I ended up bidding on the or put a bid on or this bid like because the bids go up like a dollar or two if they start off lower and I accidentally just bid on one that was going for like eight or nine dollars or something and I thought someone else might bid on one of them and I actually ended up winning so I ended up there actually wasn't even any pops on the wall that I really wanted so it was kind of stupid of me to even like, bid on it in the first place but I just kind of bid on it just to kind of see how the bidding whole, the whole bidding thing went so there's one of these ones that I'm, I mean I I have a f little thing where I kind of like I have one Funko Pop listed already so I think that for the one that I didn't really want I might just kind of put that up on the Funko or on, on my selling uh, thing on my putting on the selling thing or the thing I or what am I trying I'm gonna sell it on the whatnot app is what I'm I guess I'm trying to say whoops um oops I was thinking that might have my information on it but I from that little section I don't think there's really enough info as far as like where my address and stuff is and I mean this was one I sort of was I mean this isn't the one I was talking about before but this was just one of those ones where I kind of bid on it and there really wasn't anything I was super into but I just kind of bid on it anyway just kind of in the hope of getting something and it was a Triple H a Triple H Skull King and um, I know it's kind of glary but I mean it's I'm I guess I'm not really I've never I mean I kind of like Triple H but I not really into WWE as much as I used to be and I never was a super hit big Triple H fan I mean I used to like him at times but I honestly was never really a huge Triple H fan so this is one I might end up putting on if I if I do I'll leave a link to my whatnot like my whatnot profile on my comment or in the description below but um I said, I mean, this is still kind of a cool pop and stuff, but it's just like a common one, and it's Triple H, so again, I'm not a huge fan, and I know it's probably not going to be super easy to tell on the Funko Pop, but it's, I don't think there's really any huge damage to the box, but the back of the box does feel a little bit curved, I guess, so it almost feels like there's something kind of like, on t I guess there is a little bit like a little corner damage right there, but... It does almost feels like there's something maybe like on top of it, and it so the back's kind of curved in a little bit, but I mean it's not. 
I didn't really notice any of the creases or anything, so it's kind of one of those things where I don't know if, they, if that's just kind of how the box came, or if there's something kind of more rounded on top where it just kind of applied even pressure along the whole way, so that it didn't really leave any creases, but it's still kind of left a like a little curve on the back. Um, and then let's see this I think this was the one I was talking about it was a like a if this is the one I was thinking of as an like an NBA pop and I kind of really haven't watched or really been into the NBA in more uh, probably at least I mean I occasionally watch NBA rate related stuff but I haven't really been into the NBA since <coughs> probably like the least ten, last 15 years or 10 15 years or so it's kind of been since when I really was into NBA but uh, yep this is the one I was thinking of it's uh I mean I've heard this I guess I've kind of heard this player is a good player and everything but for me since I'm not really an NBA fan and it's not really an older player that I kind of got into when I was growing up it's not really a thing I'm into or anything, but, um, so the player is, um, Chris, Chris Tepps Porzingis, and uh, it's, uh, he's a, it's a Celtics player, I don't know, like I said, I, I don't know if he really plays on the Celtics or any, anymore or anything, but, um, it's, that's what his looks like, and then there is kind of a bit of, it's kind of hard to see. It's there's like a little crease kind of in this area, but I know it's kind of hard to see. Oh, yeah, you can kind of see it there. It's there's like a little crease there, and that's really about the only damage I see on this. But like I said it's supposed what might be one I eventually maybe put on my the whatnot app because I'm not a huge basketball fan. So um, I guess well that's one of those things where we'll we'll see kind of how it goes. And then this one was a one or the giveaway thing I talked about before, where it was just something I happened to get put my or enter into the giveaway, and it was a it was a free giveaway. They do where they do stuff where if you just like they do like a give a follow giveaway where if you follow during the giveaway they like add you into like the giveaway, so it didn't really cost anything to us. But this one's a Funko soda, I guess they're called, and I, I don't have any, or I haven't gotten any Funko sodas before, but this is a, uh, one of the Ninja Turtles, and it is a, I guess Rafael. I don't know. Oh yeah, I guess it is Raphael. Just said the on the front, it just got a picture of Raphael, so I wasn't sure if that's something that. It was just like a generic one where he's on the off cover on the front of all of them, but um, it's limited edition, twelve thousand five hundred pieces, and I, mean, I guess it's kind of good. I got this one for free because it's kind of uh, let's see if I can. It's feel. I mean, it feels like there's kind of like a, it's like a ding right there. So, I mean. I don't know if that was something, I guess I don't remember if they showed that in the video or the live stream that they were doing, but, um, so I, I don't know if, I, if I'll put this one on there or not, but it's, um, so this is, I guess, what the Funko, or the Funko Soda figures look like, so, I mean, I might just end up keeping this one because I got it essentially for free, and the can is dinged, so... I don't know if I'd really get much out of it anyways, but, and then I guess they got a coin in the bottom, um, it's one out of 10,500, so I, I mean, I guess they're supposed to be like chase versions of these, but I, I don't know if the coin thing says that they're like a chase or whatever, but I guess that's what it's supposed to mean, that this one's like one out of 10,500 pieces or whatever, but... I mean, if you know, if you're kind of in more into, like, Funko Pops and stuff, and you know kind of what that coin and stuff's supposed to mean, uh, feel free to, like, let me know down in the comment section down below. But, um, if you, if this is kind of a thing you're into, and 
here and the like Funko Pops and stuff like that. I I I don't really have any set set schedule as far as like videos and stuff I'm gonna do just because I I don't really buy Funkos on a regular basis, but I try to do a couple of month or couple of month or just like I said, just depends. Sometimes I might do a couple a week or sometimes I might do not do one for a couple weeks or whatever, but um like, like I said if you feel if you like Funko Pops or whatever, feel free to hit the like and subscribe or if you don't like feel free to dislike and like, let me know in the comments section but as always I appreciate you taking the time to stop by and hope to see you around next time as I'm spitting all over the place. <laughs>